Go. Today I'm going to perform a neurological assessment. First, um, of course, you have to provide privacy for the patient. Um, wash your hands, um, a septic technique, um, as always, and check for her vital signs, uh, temperature, pulse, blood pressure, respira respiration, and now I'm gonna have the patient state her name and birth date. Rosie, and she's five months and a half old. Thank you. Can you tell me what you're in for today? Neurological exam. Thank you. So I'm gonna ask you a few questions. Um, do you ever experience unusual or fre frequent headaches? No. Any um, difficulty speaking? No. Numbness or tingling in mm -hmm. a part of the body? All right, thank you. Now first, um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna check on her olfactory nerve. I want you to close your eyes. And press your left nostril, middle finger. I'm gonna let you smell something and tell me what it is. Cinnamon. Thank you. And do the same. The other nostril. Coffee. Thank you. So that means her olfactory nerve is intact. Now I'm going to check her visual acuity by letting her read the smelling chart. I need you to cover your left eye with your left hand and read the farthest letters that you can see. D E F T O T U T. Okay. Right eye has 20 20 vision. And I want you to do the same. The right eye. D E F P O T E T. Very good. 20 20 vision on both eyes. Now I'm going to whisper something on your ear and I want you to tell me what it is. Pizza. Chicken. Chicken. Good job. Now extend your hands, open your palm, and push my hands down, very good. Can you stand up? I'm going to test for her gait, now I need you to walk to that point, to this point, to walk back, please stand still. Extend your arms, close your eyes. You're holding a pizza. All right, perfect. Now I'm going to test for graphesthesia. Graphesthesia is Tilsi's ability to identify number or letter that's traced on the skin. I need you to close your eyes, open your palm, and I'm going to trace a letter or a number and tell me what it is. Good job. Now for pain and light touch. I'm going to um, use one sharp object, one dull object, and one um, soft object and um, test your pain and light touch. Can you close your eyes? Very good. I need you to extend your arm, close your eyes, and tell me if I'm moving your fingers up or down. Up, down, down, up. Good job. And I'll do the same for the toes. So close your eyes. test for her reflexes, deep tendon reflexes, starting with the left tricep. Goodbye.
concepts. And break your own yes. The knees. And can you lay on your belly? Press both feet tender with my toes over ankle. Thank you. Now I'm going to test her for stereognosis. This is the ability to recognize common objects from tactile cues like texture, size, and shape. So I want you to tell me. Close your eyes. I want you to tell me what I put on your hand. Coin. Good job. Coin. Very good. Please run your right foot down your shin, down your left shin, and do the same on the other foot. Very good. So her movements are smooth and accurate. Now I'm going to test for pupillary, for any pupillary defects on her eyes by swinging the flashlight from left eye to right eye and vice versa. Okay, no pupillary defect observed. Thank you so much, and that ends my neurological assessment for today. Thank you.